So today I talked about a Nissan with the P1168 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. And so what is a Nissan P1168 code? Well, it's a closed loop control function bank two. And what does this mean? Well, an engine can run inside of either an open loop or a closed loop. And in order for the computer to take control of the air fuel ratio mixture going into the cylinders, it needs to operate in what's called a closed loop. And so in order to do this, there's oxygen sensors down on the exhaust and they're reporting back to the computer how much oxygen was burnt off. And the computer is using this information to fine tune the air fuel ratio mixture that's going into the engine. When it's in an open loop, it's not using the O2 sensor for feedback. And basically when this happens, it's just guessing what it should be sending into the engine. Now this will happen when the engine first starts up. Until the engine warms up, it will be in an open loop. But once the engine warms up and this O2 sensor is reading the oxygen levels that's burnt off during combustion, it should be reporting this back to the computer. And when it does report this information back to the computer, the computer is going to know the exact air fuel ratio mixture that should be going into the cylinder. And so when you get this P1168 code, there's some kind of issue going on with that O2 sensor reporting back this information to the computer and it's not able to go into what's called the closed loop. And V6 and V8 engines, they're going to have two banks. Bank one is always the side of the engine with the number one cylinder. And then the opposite of that is bank two. And so bank two is the side of the engine that's having the problem. And the basics of what's going on with these O2 sensors is that there's going to be two of them. You're going to have one called sensor one that's located before the catalytic converter, also called the upstream oxygen sensor. And you're going to have one after the catalytic converter that's called sensor two or the downstream oxygen sensor. And the one the computer's seeing an issue with is going to be the sensor one on bank two, which is going to be located down on the exhaust right before the catalytic converter. It can be a good idea to get a diagram for your specific Nissan where all these O2 sensors are located. It just makes it easier. For example, this is a 2011 Nissan Frontier. And as you can see, bank two sensor one is located right here. And it's going to be before the catalytic converter. And so once you locate that O2 sensor, you can't test it if you want to. I made some videos on how you go about testing these. I'll put a link down below if you need it. A lot of people would just go ahead and replace it. But the first thing to do is to go locate that bank two sensor one oxygen sensor and either test it or replace it. Another thing to check out is check out the wiring. And basically just keep in mind, anything wrong with the wiring, open, short, bad connection, these kind of things is gonna cause the same symptoms as a bad sensor. So be sure that looks good and there's no issues going on there. Also keep in mind that these could be on a fuse. It could be kind of vague sometimes which fuse it's on. And quite often when a fuse blows, it's gonna cause other O2 sensor errors. So if you're not getting other O2 sensor errors, then very likely the fuse is good. But just keep in mind that a blowing fuse can cause issues. Also keep a lookout for any kind of exhaust leaks because exhaust leaks can throw these sensors off and cause weird things to happen because more air is getting into the system than should be and the O2 sensor is reading this. So keep a lookout for any exhaust leaks since an exhaust leak can't cause issues. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to give a basic overview of how you go about fixing a Nissan with the P1168 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe and have a good day.